Questioner. Is all of the Earth's population then the human population of the Earth? Are all of them originally from Maldek? I am wrong. This is a new line of questioning, and deserves a place of its own. The ones who were harvested to your sphere, from the sphere known before its dissolution as other names, but to your peoples as Maldek, incarnated, many within your Earth's surface, rather than upon it. The population of your planet contains many various groups, harvested from other second dimension and cycled third dimension spheres. You are not all one race or background of beginning. The experience you share is unique to this time-space continuum. Questioner. I think it would be appropriate to discover how the Law of One acts in this transfer of beings to our planet and the action of harvest. I am wrong. The Law of One states simply that all things are one, that all beings are one. There are certain behaviors and thought forms consonant with the understanding and practice of this law. Those who, finishing a cycle of experience, demonstrate various grades of distortion of that understanding of thought and action, will be separated, by their own choice, into the vibratory distortion most comfortable to their mind-body-spirit complexes. This process is guarded, or watched, by those nurturing beings who, being very close to the law of one in their distortions, nevertheless have the distortion towards active service. Thus, the illusion is created of light, or more properly, but less understandably, light love. This is in varying degrees of intensity. The spirit complex of each harvested entity moves along the line of light until the light grows too glaring, at which time the entity stops. This entity may have barely reached third density, or may be very, very close to the ending of the third density, light, love, distortion, vibratory complex. Nevertheless, those who fall within this octave of intensifying light love then experience a major cycle during which the opportunities are many for the discovery of the distortions which are inherent in each entity and, therefore, the lessening of these distortions.